Hey what's up guys welcome to Customize Detroit. Today's video is regarding how to uninstall system app on any rooted android phone. Requirement is any rooted android phone, titanium backup app. It's a root app and is available for free to download right from the play store. I have already downloaded the titanium backup app. It's a rooted app and it is free available in the play store. You can go ahead in the play store and write, download it right from the play store and it's available for free. I will show you some of the app which I have installed from the play store and some of the system process app and show you how to uninstall the system process app. Uh, go to app menu. Uh, first of all I will list all the apps which I have uh, downloaded and which is there on my phone. Uh, the app list is getting loaded. Uh, this process works only on the rooted android phone you can uninstall the system process app only if your phone is rooted so here is some of the app the file manager app which i have downloaded right from the play store if you click on this app you get the uninstall option right from here so there are some i will show you some of the system process app like the gmail app if you click on the gmail app uh, and you go and check the option for the uninstall you get the uninstall updates option but not uninstalling the phone so uh, I will show you how to uninstall this Gmail app from the Titanium backup app. The Hangout app also, the, you only get the uninstall updates option and not the uninstall option for, for these two apps. As it, as it is a system process app, so you don't get the uninstall option right from here. So I will go and click on the Titanium backup app first and open the app. Once you open the app, it will populate all the apps which is installed on your phone and it will scan for all the apps and for the files and folders. There are many options in this app. It's a rooted app. You can backup and restore the app also. So I will click on this option. After clicking on the option, you, you will see all the apps, the system process app, the downloaded apps right here in one place. Uh, in You can see all the list it is arranged alphabetically so i will go on the uh, app which i want to uninstall so i will search for gmail uh, here it is so i will click on gmail uh, you can see the uninstall option on the right hand side so i'll just have click uninstall and it will prompt you for some warning message do you want to uninstall it click on yes as it is a system process app it is giving a message click on yes again and the app will be uninstalled the uh, the benefit of uninstalling system process app is like as you don't want this app uh, on your phone it's your phone if you want to customize it and if you don't want this app and you don't want this app to run in background and eat your memory so you can uninstall the system process app with this rooted app called the titanium backup app and it will no more available on your phone so i will also uninstall the hangout say i don't use it normally so i will uninstall it so and it will be uninstalled from my phone yes and yes and it's done you in this is the simple way of uninstalling the system process app via titanium backup there are many options in this app you can go ahead and check out from your own this process works only on the rooted android phones if you guys want to check out how to root any android phone the tutorial is available in my channel and you can also check out the description column for the link and uh, there is a dedicated video regarding how to root Sony Xperia Tipo. So you can check in the description column or you can also check in my channel. The video tutorial is available. So I will show you in the app drawable see uh, there is no hangout app. There is no gmail app as it has been uninstalled. Uh, reboot your phone once after uninstalling. It is recommended just reboot your phone once and it's done. So that's it for now in Customize Detroit. If you guys enjoyed this video, do hit the like button and comment on the comment column in case of any queries. You can also post in the request in the comment columns regarding the video tutorial. So stay tuned to my channel for further updated videos. Till then, bye guys and enjoy customizing your phone. Don't forget to subscribe.